Y'all, it's your boy, man, DJ Kills on Jones. Oh, man, DJ Kills on Jones. Remember the name, remember you lame, and yeah, bruh. Uh, Frank Ocean left, let his fans down. Let his fans down. Let his fans down with the delay of Boys Don't Cry. That's his new album. You know, Frank Ocean been off the scene, been very quiet on the scene since he, you know, came out as, uh, he came out the closet, you know what I'm saying? Since he came out that he was a bisexual guy or, you know what I'm saying, part of the LBGT community and everything, um, which I don't like him for. A lot of people in the industry stopped messing with Frank. Frank got started getting depressed and he started becoming a, re a recluse. You know what I'm saying? He just, you know, stick, stuck to himself and, um, you know what I'm saying? Stayed to his, you know, to himself and, you know, he talked to his industry friends, but he really ain't been on the scene like that ever since he dropped that, uh, Channel Orange and, you know, that Thinking About You. I still listen to that Thinking About You record, man, and it was really, really instrumental on, on my life at that time. You know what I'm saying? I had, um, a relationship that I was in and everything else like that, and, that song, you know, kind of helped me to get back in a good place. Um, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, but, uh, you know, things change, times change. And, you know, when you feel in that instrumental amount of pressure, I thought, I think maybe he thought being 100 with people um, about his sexuality and being open about his sexuality would turn a lot of people on and it turned a lot of people off. And since then, the world's got even more progressively upset uh, uh, accepting of the lbg lbgt community especially with everything that's going on in the world right now and um just think man it is it's just you know it's just that time bro like i think this is that time for a dude to come back and really just be an r&b singer i think people are past uh, everything else that was going on and the outcry is you know what i'm saying um it, it is is phenomenal you know what i'm saying for this man to come back so i hope he come back he make good music um you know what i'm saying is and he makes traditional type r&b and he mixes it up but he doesn't do it too much to where like it's you know what i'm saying it's that that defines his sound like he has range he could do records with rap he was doing records with rappers um you know, before it became a trending thing to do only like Trey Songs and maybe Lloyd that was doing it. Like he was, he was the one that set that trend for the, you know, Bryson Tellers and the Tory Lanes and the, even Chris Brown at that time had just started, you know, rapping and stuff. But Frank Ocean had been doing it, rapping and singing and doing everything else with Our Future and Tyler the Creator and everybody. Everybody wanted to see him back. You know what I'm saying? Had that big, you know, no church in a while with 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 Hove and um. With Kanye, with uh with Kanye, so it's like, let's just get back to, you know what I'm saying. Let's get back to the music, Frank. Everybody want to hear what you got, you know what I'm saying. The fans want to hear what you got. So this your boy man DJ Kills on Jones, and we have been thinking about you, bro. You know the ladies been thinking about you, the fellas been thinking about you. Don't matter what their sexual orientation is. I I just I can only speak for me, and I like good music, and I know a lot of my subscribers like good music too. So this your boy man. Holla at your boy, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Tag that shirt is. Tweet this to Frank Ocean. You know what I'm saying? Tell him to watch and everything. And I'm out, man. Peace.